let's take a problem of issue of debentures at par journal entries to be passed this is a case of over subscription okay so let's see the question first xyz limited issued 9000 11 percent debentures of rupees 1000 each for which rupees 200 was payable on application rupees 800 at the time of allotment the public applied for 11,000 debentures out of which 9,000 were duly allotted to the applicants and the entire money in respect of the balance 2,000 was refunded. You are required to give the necessary journal entries. Now whenever you do these kinds of questions, the first thing you should do is just draw a table. Okay. So what is the number of shares which were issued? Number of debentures actually. Forgive me for using sh this word share. I guess we've been using it too often that it comes and falls in every time in my term. So there were 9000 which were issued. <clears throat> the public applied for 11,000. Applied for was 11,000 right out of which 9,000 were duly allotted to the applicants so how many were allotted allotted was 9,000 and the entire money in respect of the balance 2,000 was refunded so we have a refund column as well 2,000 refunded Okay, so when you issued 9,000 shares, you made an offer, was there any money that you received? The answer is zero. Let's say this is for money received. When you applied, when people applied, the public applied, they applied for 11,000 shares, 11,000 debentures. So when they applied for 11,000 debentures, they would have paid the application money along with that. And how was the application money? The application money was 200. Right? So the total money which they received at the time of application was this much. 22 lakh. So this is what you got on application. right so when you did this application out of this you allotted only 9000 right so how much application money was supposed to be used for the allotment of these shares it's 9000 into 200 right 18 double zero triple zero so out of this 22 lakh 18 lakh is what was actually due to the company and the balance was to be refunded. So refunded is 22 lakh minus 18 lakh, which is 4 lakh. If you compute it otherwise also, the refund is 2000 shares into the application money that you got, 200. This into this gives you this. Right? Now you must be wondering, what is the use of this table that I have prepared? This table is extremely helpful. Calculation of funds at each stage right now let's pass the journal entries in respect of this so how many there was nothing at the time of issue at the time of application I guess this is not the color I should be using application You received 22 lakh rupees, so you will pass the entry bank account debit. You received 22 lakh or 2200,000. Two, what is the reason why did you receive this money? 
receive this money because on account of debenture application account so you write to 11 percent debenture application account and put in the narration here I'm not going to include the narration but the narration will be being amount received on account of share application money on account of debenture application money on 11,000 debentures at the rate of 200 per share so we have completed this leg now this debenture application money is on two accounts so we debit the debenture application account right debit by 22,000,000 now where do you transfer this entire money I mean what is this money on account of as I told you this 22 lakh basically falls in two categories something which is due on application of money right and something which is due this allotted is I think creating a little bit of a confusion I'll just remove this from here right so two first thing is out of this 22 lakh 18 lakh is an account of what 11 percent debentures so you credit 11 percent debenture account right and the balance 4 lakh what do you need to do this because you are not making an allotment you are refunding this right when you refund you make a payment when you make a payment your bank balance goes down so you have to credit the bank account when you receive the money you had debited the bank account when you pay the money you credit the bank account and you simply put in the narration being the amount received at the time of allotment of 11% debenture or sorry at the time of 11% debenture application transferred to the 11% debenture account for 9000 debentures and refund for 2000 debentures now comes the allotment the allotment is fairly simple why because rupees 800 is what is due on allotment on 9000 debentures so you just simply debit the debenture allotment account by 800 into 9000 which is 7200,000 or 72 lakh as you call it to 11 percent debenture account why is this money due? This money is due on account of 11% debentures. Right? And when you receive the cash, the bank, what do you do? You just debit bank account, debit to, what is this money received on account of? This is received on account of debenture allotment account. So 7200,000 here. okay what was the catch here the catch here was that you had to see that if you received money for 11,000 accounts you apply only 9,000 so you got 22 lakh but you applied only 18 lakh okay and the balance 4 lakh was to be refunded there is no impact at the time of allotment because all this thing happens at the time of application